hello guys welcome to my youtube channel and today we are going to solve the sql question asked in a uh, curatel interview question uh, okay curatel interview basically so here's the question so the question is below you can use mysql server on your own machine if you have access else you can use the following link okay so this links uh, takes you to the other site i'll show you that first let us understand the problem statement so a table called merge log has the following definition so they have created one table with merge id profile id and merged into three columns and they have inserted these values okay so one two two four three four five six okay and the problem statement is write a query that will return the profile id uh, as old id and final merged into id as new id for that profile id okay for that profile id for example uh, suppose one was merged into two and two was merged into four therefore the fi uh, final merged into id for one is four so one should be assigned to four in the final statement okay and they have also given the sample output here like this old id and new id so your output should be one four two four three four and five six okay so let's go here first and let's understand what it is so when i run this uh, okay so you can see that uh four rows will be created okay i need to refresh it okay since i was doing it let me control x and refresh it okay so this is the site which they had mentioned uh in the uh, doc okay so i'll paste it here and if i run this so four rows affected now i will select star from merge log okay so i will select this and then i will run okay so this is okay i don't want the add so this is the data that is merged id is there profile id and merged into is there okay so four rows are there okay and we we, we need to use the cd okay so for that let's go to sql workbench okay so let's have this in two way okay so that we'll understand it in better manner so the query goes like this so basically uh this is the query so with with recursive abc as so select profile id merged into okay from merge log that is profile id merged into uh, you can also select merge id doesn't really matter okay and where profile id is not equal to merged into okay so that is the first condition okay so if i run this just this okay so i will get this output 1 2 2 4 uh 3 4 and 5 6 okay and union all uh, select a dot profile id a is nothing but abc okay alias for abc and this is a dot profile id which is this okay and m dot merged into this is this okay merged into this is m square okay and uh, from abc join merge log m on m dot profile id so this is m dot profile id uh is equal to a dot merged into a dot merge into okay and finally i will select this select profile id and merge into okay so uh, this i will not run first so first i'll make you understand this so what will happen here into a dot merge into here is so firstly you we, you will get the output as 1 and 2 okay and after that what will happen uh, the recursive query starts working so first input will be uh, what it is m dot profile id is equal to a dot merge into so you will get 2 okay and for two it will go and search for two profile id okay and the merge into is four for here so what happens here next iteration one is assigned to four in the next iteration okay now in the second iteration we have two and four now four is the merge into it will go and look for profile id four which is not here not there here so what it does the recursion stops that's it okay so in the final statement if i run this you will see this output basically one two two four 3 4 5 6 and 1 4 okay but what we want output here is 1 4 2 4 3 4 and 5 6 okay so what we need to do here is uh, we need to use max of merge into and then we need to use group by uh, profile id okay now if i run this you will see the expected output there so 1 4 2 4 3 4 and 5 6 Which is the output one four two four three four and five six okay so uh, okay they want also the names different what it is old ID and new ID okay so let me rename that 
select profile id as old id and max of merge into as new id okay so this works guys so let me enter so if i run this finally you will get this output okay so let me let me do this and then this and now this so here you can see old id 1 4 2 4 3 4 5 6 and new id old id 1 4 2 4 3 4 and 5 6 okay so this is the expected output they wanted in the interview question okay so this is the curatal question which was asked recently uh, we need to do ct using recursion okay of the sql so go through this if you want this uh, just comment it out i will put it in the description and here's the query okay you can just uh, take the screenshot of it or you can try it okay okay so hope this helps so this was all about today guys if you learned something from this video do hit the subscribe button until then take care bye, -bye.